Here's a quick peek at some of my Spanish lessons for today. And like my quotes say, never be afraid to ask for help. Gallos a la madrina. Cerveza, I know that one. Two for twenty-five. Which means that's what twelve fifty each. Divide by seven, it's not even two bucks. There you go. Uh Kubet Tazo. This is how I look at menus. I mean, what the heck is that draft? Oh, it's a beer. But why is it called a cubetazo? I don't know. It must have more stuff in it. I don't know. Churros mas chocolate caliente. So you get hot chocolate with your churros. Croquetas de jamón. And croquettes. Fritura de mar. Uh, something with seafood, a fritter with seafood? I don't know. Then they have almuerzos y ejecutivos, which is seven bucks. And you get, I don't know, it looks like fish and veggies. I don't know. You know, it's hard to read menus, that's for sure. You never know what you're going to get, but it's always delicious. In the mommy line at school, picking up kids. I'm giving you a peek at the traffic next to the school. Even though this is a school zone, there's really no speed limit here. <laughs> you had yogurt? Mm -hmm. Was it good? Yeah, and my teacher and I have spoons that I use. We have spoons at home. Mommy, why not feed me spoons? We have little spoons. I'll show you where they are. Okay. Did you have a good day at school? Yeah. No, they're at home. Tell me, what did you do? Show me your pine cones. What are they called? Como se llama en español? Oh. What did you do today at school? Mommy, Mommy, can steal my Oh, oh, yes. Oh, sweaty. What? Mommy, we just danced at school today. You danced? Yeah. What? We danced Ballerina that oh Giovanni, what'd you do? Let me see your ladybug. Let me see. Turn it around. Ooh, a ladybug. Como se dice? Mar what's it called? Mar Mariqueta. Mariqueta. What's no, it called? Mariqueta. Mar yeah. Yeah. Si. Yeah. And the que color? And the rojo. Rojo, si. And the way the boy beats so me not school today. Why? And you one. What'd he do? Him the I'm not lying. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. Oh, it's a ladybug. Look. Oh, it's I love it. One. It's a crazy one. Muy loca. Mommy, a boy. Uh -huh. I can't eat that, Mommy. Thank yeah. you. So beautiful. Oh, I'm not a beautiful. Wow. I love them. We'll put them on the fridge. <gasps> Fun? Yeah. Yeah. You can keep it on. Well, well. What the I love it. It's beautiful. Teddy on on our chair down. It's a teddy. Oh, on your chair? Okay. Yeah, okay. I like yeah, the super glue. Super, on, super, super, super. I want to find a spot so this can hang up. Okay. All right. Are we ready to go home? Here we go. I'm not yeah. ready.
Don't worry, Pouty Amelia got a turn as well. They played all day on this swing. Mercedes was kind enough to hang it today and play with the kids some. Oh, look, look, there's Andrea. She's pushing Giovanni. More Spanish for me. This is butterfly Spanish. I kind of like her. I know, I know, the dog is corny, but I still, I like her a lot. And I'm watching the kids play. Not a bad deal. It's 2.30, and as I sit here studying Spanish, we're having the nicest rainstorm. Oh, I love it. And I know I am really, you're getting a lot of rain too. Don't you just love it? Mid-afternoon, ugh, deliciousness. Yahoo! Waiting on Miss Cathia to come, but I'm sure she'll wait till after the rain. Hello friends, hello, hello, hello. Ending the evening, cooking a little bit of pasta for the kids. Little, um, it kind of, to me, looks like ramen noodles. Look, but this is the noodles. It doesn't have all that crap that goes in it. Not that the noodles are good for you either, but anyway, that, and um, I'm pretty fancy at night. So let's see what else I have. I'm gonna give them, um, look at these bananas. I'm gonna give them some banana, and um, I wish they liked uh, uh, aguacate, give them that, but instead we're gonna have this, which is pepperoni, salami, and noodles, and bananas, what can I say? It's my fancy way of cooking. They like it, they eat it, and gives them a little bit of meat, a little bit of pasta, a little bit of fruit, and top all the goodies they've had all day. Anyway, it's been a great day. I had my Spanish class. They had their Spanish class. They had school. Um, Mercedes was here. Andrea was here. Katia was here. I mean, like, we're a powerhouse of women, let me say. We're just a powerhouse of women. Um, the girls, I call them that. I'm 55. They're 24. So I don't mean to offend anybody when I say the girls, but the girls to me, okay? So Andrea and Mercedes are only 24, and um, Katia is only 29. So they're girls, but um, it's so nice to have them all here. And um, you know, they speak they speak Spanish quite well. So it's it's nice for me because I'm trying to get these pepperonis out. Sorry, because look at that. See, they'll be so happy. Look at that. Anyway, it's good for for all of us, and it gives them someone to play with. And like today, the uh, girls are already showered, ready for bed. Giovanni, I'll shower in the morning. Um, the laundry's done. The house is clean. <laughs> what to say? The meals were cooked. Their refraction is ready for in the morning. So um, let's see. I think it should be in here. Let's look. Yep, there they are. There's their little lunches. Which it's not really lunch. We come home and eat lunch. That's just their mid-morning snack. But they're all doing so good in school. They love it. They're so excited. And and I love it. And I love that. Um, you know, part of coming here was because. You can have help, um, and, and they're, they're, the girls are glad to come and help. I mean, they want work. So, like, Andrea comes from almost 20 minutes away by motorcycleta or sometimes by bus to help. And I asked Mercedes tonight, why, why doesn't she work closer to her house? Because there's no work. There's no work. 
Um, yeah. So um, for her, and her mom is in the same residential area as I am working, and her sister is also here in another home. So they've got three of them working in three separate houses here, um, which is great. And then Mercedes does not live as far. She lives about 10 minutes from my house. And, um, and she's worked in other places. You know, she worked in an ice cream place and she's, she's worked for other families. And um, she, she likes working with us and we love having her here. So it works out really well and it gives me a break. Um, if I wanted to go somewhere in the afternoon, the kids are totally safe and taken care of here in the house. And I love that. Um, I don't know, it's, it's, it's just really nice. And everything's at a better pace. Um, also, Kethia is reinforcing. Actually, she's teaching their Spanish, and I think the school's reinforcing what she's teaching. And it was really cute today because Gianna came home, and she's been my most resistant to um, trying to learn Spanish. She doesn't really want to use the words. Amelia's having a lot of fun with it. Even Giovanni, I mean, it's just catching. Um, but uh, Gianna has not really wanted to. So today, uh, when I picked her up and I'd ask her something and I'd say something to her, and I always ask my kids to respond because otherwise, I don't know if they've heard me. Um, and so I, said, I always make them say, yes, mom. I said, do you, do you understand? Have you heard me? Did you hear what I just said? Yes, mom, yes, mom. Okay, then I, you don't have any excuse for not doing what I ask because I know you heard me. Well, her response today was, see, mama, see, mama. And I'm like, oh, she's starting to, she's starting to do it. So. Um, with school, I think it's going to be great. Uh, and this is four weeks of it, and then they'll have four weeks out, and then they'll start again. So I think it's going to be great. I think it'll be easy for them. Oh, Burt Reynolds died. I just saw that. Aww. That's so sad. Y'all remember Burt Reynolds? That just came across my phone. Aww. I mean, I guess it's time. We all have a, we all have a stamp on us, don't we? But gosh. Some of these people, like, good lord. Anyway, I love Burt Reynolds. Um, I, you know, off to school again in the morning, off to Spanish school, and no Miss Gethia tomorrow. It rained really good here today. I know you guys are getting a lot of rain in the States, and especially in Amarillo, which we never get rain. I, I cannot believe it. I'm so excited. Rain, rain. We just love it. I love the rain. So anyway, I'm gonna go feed my kids their healthy, um, and um, relax with them tonight. I did Spanish all day long. Thanks, thanks be to my girls that are in the house, and thanks be to God to give me the time to do that. So I feel pretty um, studied up, and I'm going to enjoy my kids and watch a little TV with them. So you guys have a fantastic rest of your evening, and um, I'll see you on the next video. Bye, everybody. A little yoga exercise class at Montessori today. And here's a few... Remember friends, sometimes asking for help is the bravest move you can make. You don't have to go it alone. And boy, am I thankful for that. That's a tough lesson to learn, isn't it? And don't forget, this is a collective journey. Don't be afraid to ask for help and to show your children that strong people support others and accept support. We don't have to do it alone. I'm thankful for the support that I've got. 
Don't be afraid, friends. Ask for help if you need it. Have a fantastic rest of your night, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye, everybody.